Hi friends, how are you? Today we are going to paint a monochromic color based paint and you can see it's like a acrylic, acrylic color and uh, the frame you can see here it's made of totally bamboo slices okay so bamboo slices those are just arranged here horizontally you can see one after one in a parallel combination so all these are in a uh, arranged like you know the horizontal basis and two sides of the borders you can see the vertical axis here so this is a DIY handmade bamboo frame and I'm going to do the acrylic paint here. So it's like a canvas but with a very rough texture. So we are going to use the brush strokes in a special types and you cannot apply the traditional brush strokes here. So let's see. Let's start the drawing and you can observe it and uh, you can learn if you observe closely. So do not, do not pass any video. Just watch the whole video and uh, see how I'm going to draw. So in this case, I'm not going to edit any part of the videos as for your better convenience. And you know, uh, the real time video, you can understand that how much longer time it can take up to the maximum time limits. So uh, hopefully it can be uh, done in eight or nine minutes. I, I think so. Let's see how much time it's going to take. So in this corner, you can see I'm going to paint uh, in a few strokes the tree so it's like a taller tree you can see the date palm tree or other types of tree which is seen regular basis in a tropical countries okay and especially in the sea beach you can see lots of these like a coconut tree or some other palm trees so it has a longer branches and something like a slices of the of the you know the leaves which is very uh, thinner and the longer and uh, something like an umbrella you can see the formations on the tops of each of the trees here so it looks like umbrella formation but not totally like the umbrella so it has some uh, dividation points for each branches let's put two on the tops then the drawing is going to be complete so i have told you in the beginning that this is going to be a monochromic color based painting so I am applying here the pink color, which is a very warm color, nice color, color of love and the, you know, happiness. That's why I have selected these colors. And the base, you can see the bamboo frame, all the slices here, those are colored a little bit white here. Because the white is like, a, you know, a little bit brighter color, it makes things brighter. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry. If I use the uh, darker darker color based print then you can see all the colors can be uh, wiped out or uh, maybe you know absorbed in the black background in this case some things might not be visible but white color you can see here everything is going to be very very uh, nicely visible very easily clearly visible i'm gonna say okay so two trees you can see here are almost done now i'm going to put some base here so this base is usually the uh, grass types in the island banks of the rivers and you can see the grass types i'm going to put something strokes like on the top and in the base the strokes is starting in the base and just i'm moving to the top okay so for better convenience let's use some waters here and make the color like a full same monochromic color in this corner so this is how it looks like a island and on the uh, land based you know the base here two trees are just grown up now if you like to put the uh, colors like this one you can see this is going to define the uh, river banks and the shapes of the water on the islands so in this case if you want to just show it like the river or the ocean so put some little strokes here okay so in the horizon you can uh, draw a sun okay so for this one let's put a you know half circle little bit bigger so that uh, you can easily understand it so that the shape of the sun is clearly visible so in this case just try to make it as round shaped as possible and as you know the arch is round shaped so you can see only the half part which is actually the top part of the sun and there's the upper part of the half circle and the lower part of the half circle or the bottom part is not that, that much visible 
so if you want to show it like a, the sun rising then you have to put the strokes which is just going to distribute it radially from the center and that defines the layers of the sunshine when it's just going up to the sky okay so very simple and easy you can see the landscape based and the natural scenery okay you can do practice at home the better you practice the better the drawing to be okay so most of the time you have to practice it mm -hmm. all right and for the uh, prominent color or the darker color in the land area here you have to add some uh, more color and also you can add some color on the top which is sometimes you know in some multiple stages you have to put the colors because sometimes after putting the color you can see maybe some colors absorbed away within the frame so you have to put the second time strokes on top of it so hopefully uh, i'm going to finish it uh, in between like uh, eight minutes or the seven minutes let's see just doing the details of the taller you know the main body of the tree here okay so a little bit details left for the grasses at the bottom and uh, after uh, completing that one the drawing is going to be done okay you know for the painting this is the actual beauty is that it's it just depends on your imagination so you can draw any color like you want so usually you know all types of trees and its branches leaves usually it has a color of the green color but here in my imagination i just painted the pink color so that depends on your creativity and the how do you want to show your creativity in your paintings okay so the drawing is almost finished it's a very basic simple and elementary drawing thanks for watching i hope you like the video one more thing if you just put the strokes here like this one just try to do the strokes like the horizontal you know the progression if you want to do it like the vertical progression then you know because of the rough textures of the multiple you know slices here the color doesn't uh, mix up with the, the frame so you have to put the strokes like the horizontal then the uh, you know the color is going to be very nice there's the main idea so when you work with any types of frame just try to understand the texture texture and the you know the surface pattern of the frame or the canvas then you can uh, understand just which way you want to uh, complete the painting here so that's it for today thanks for watching i hope you like the video please subscribe the channel and put the bell icon on to get the updates in our later videos we're going to put more interesting things and uh, until then stay nice stay healthy stay fine thank you so much have a good day